This AV production teaches preventive diabetic food care to people with diabetes from all over the world. By following the do's and don'ts, and paying attention to warning and danger signs, and taking simple measures to protect and care for feet, it is possible to prevent most foot ulcers and amputations. Do you know that in a lifetime, a human being walks about 100,000 miles? That's like walking around the world almost four times. Now imagine, halfway through your life, having to do this on one foot, or even on a wheelchair. Hello, I'm Dr. Fitfoot. Do you see now how much your feet support you in your lifetime? And tell me, how much do you support your feet? This question becomes critical for those who live with diabetes. Wherever you may be, Asia, Africa, Latin America. Do you know that apart from accidents, maximum foot amputations are done on people with diabetes? The reason is, they don't feel pain in their feet. And that's the problem. If you live with diabetes, this video gives you basic tips on foot care, so you can lead a healthy, productive life. This video is broadly divided into do's, don'ts and danger signs. First, the do's. Use a mirror to check your feet daily. Look for cuts, bruises, blisters, color changes, swelling, ingrown toenails and open sores. Always protect your feet against injury by appropriate footwear. Keep wounds covered with clean dressing. Wash feet daily with soap and water. Take care to wash between the toes. Dry feet carefully, especially between the toes. Keep skin soft by using lotion on the top and bottom of your feet, but not between toes. Preferably, do this at bedtime. Cut toenails straight across and file the sharp edges. Before putting them on, check shoes daily for rough places. Any irritating objects, pebbles, nails, Wear cotton socks that are washed daily. They must fit well and have no holes. Buy shoes at the end of the day as feet swell during the day. Avoid rough seams. Wear them for short periods at first. Have your feet checked by your doctor periodically. Now let's see what you should avoid. The important don'ts. Don't let your feet get dry and cracked. Don't go barefoot, either indoors or outside. Since the diabetic foot does not feel pain, see what can happen until gangrene sets in. Do not use hot water to wash your feet. Don't wear torn or tight shoes, or shoes with rough and uneven seams. Avoid shoes with narrow toe box, sandal with thumb between toes, 
or footwear that have just straps and no back support. Don't wear tight socks. Do not use corn medicines, blade, knife or any sharp instruments. Do not use a hot water bag or warm your feet at the fire. You may burn them. You should avoid smoking too. Avoid visiting religious places in the hot sun. You may burn your feet. Ensure your foot is not in contact with the exhaust pipe of a motorcycle. Now let me tell you about the danger signs. If you become aware of any of these danger signs, seek help from your doctor immediately. Your foot becomes painful. Your foot becomes noticeably red or has any unusual discoloration. You feel a part or all of your foot is much hotter than usual. There is a discharge of any kind from your feet. Your foot smells bad. Your foot has an open sore or blister. You feel generally unwell with nausea, vomiting or high temperature. You have unusual difficulty keeping your blood sugar under control. Please follow these guidelines unfailingly. Your doctor can only advise. It is your foot. Remember, foot problems will not be painful, but can still be very serious. You have to act. After all, we have a long way to go, isn't it? <laughs>